step with me into the shadows of ancient Delphi, where the ethereal veil between gods and mortals was at its thinnest. In this sacred sanctuary, a young priestess named Pythia found herself chosen to be the oracle, a conduit through which the divine spoke. Let me unveil the mystique of the oracle of Delphi, a figure whose words held the very fabric of destiny. In the year 580 BCE, Pythia ascended the sacred tripod within the temple of Apollo. The air thickened with otherworldly mists as she inhaled the intoxicating vapors emanating from the sacred chasm. It was believed that these fumes connected her to Apollo, the god of prophecy. In her trance-like state, Pythia delivered prophecies. Her eyes glazed and her voice transformed. Kings, generals, and seekers from far and wide flocked to Delphi, drawn by the promise of insights into matters of war, love, and the twists of fate. The oracle's utterances, a blend of cryptic riddles and poetic metaphors, left all who sought her wisdom in a state of both awe and confusion. One notable seeker, King Croesus of Lydia, sought assurance from the oracle about the outcome of a military campaign. The oracle, in her enigmatic way, foretold the downfall of a great empire. Dismissing her words, Croesus marched into battle only to witness the crumbling of his own empire. The whispers of Delphi continue to reverberate through time, with the prophecies of the oracle a beacon of divine insight or a reflection of ancient wisdom. If the mystique of Delphi has enchanted you, join us for more expeditions into the wonders of history. Like and subscribe to stay connected with tales that transcend the boundaries of time.